No, 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 because, I mean, well, first of all, let me put a bias out there. You're speaking to a philosopher, so maybe my, my view may be a little uh, philosophical, but the idea of preserving hip-hop has less to do with preserving its, its products or its uh, environment. It has more to do with preserving the actual tradition, the behavior, mm -hmm. the consciousness. Uh, teach our children to self-create. Mm -hmm. to not depend on a system, not depend on an inheritance. Get up for yourself, define yourself, create yourself. Now, if we can preserve that, we'll preserve hip-hop. Well, guys like Soulja Boy are doing that. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. I mean, that's that's why we addressed it. What's up, man? 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 Yeah. 
That's my dude, yo primo, take us out. love of hip hop so I was doing it when there was no money. You know what I'm saying? I was doing it when, you know, we had to go and just get out there and just make people just see us. You know what I'm saying? It was no nothing. You know, so I come from that ever to all the way from to now. You know what I'm saying? Being on that stage that night with Chris, that was like a monumental moment for me. You know what I'm saying? Because I got a chance to get up there and rhyme, which I don't even really do. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and the whole grind of it is, you know what I'm saying? When sitting on the street corner selling the mixtapes, you know what I'm saying? Going to all the parties, telling the kids, you know what I'm saying? This is me, I'm kicking free, listening to my joint, giving it to them, letting them hear it. You know what I'm saying? It's pretty much the same as right now. When I get up in the spot, man, I want everybody to hear me. I want everybody to know, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to make your night incredible. You know what I'm saying? And and, and, and and that's what the whole attitude is. I truly love hip hop. I truly love what I'm doing. And I've been loving it for a long time. And if I fell off the marble, I'll still be doing it. And that's the attitude that keeps me moving. You know what I mean? Most definitely. Yeah.